What's up guys, welcome back. Halloween season is upon us. Michael Myers from the movie Halloween, the series. So, I'm in a landscape page, use a pencil eraser, hit pause if I go too fast. So, center point of my page is here. Come up over to the right hand side, we're gonna start with those black eyes. Simplest way to start. And they're kind of like shaped like a lemon, okay? So, you just do a curved line up and down here. All right? And then, bring it back underneath so it's kind of like a lemon shape a lemon or a grain of rice kind of a thing so his other eye about eye width right between them maybe a little bit less because they're like it's a it's a mask so it's like the width of the eye probably fits there maybe a little bit less yeah like a little bit smaller and then this curves over down to there. And then another sort of lemon shape like that. And then you color in black. Like so. Right, so then we got like some extra details around his eye. So like like these little edge lines and eyelid lines coming around the eye here. Right? And then he's got sort of bags underneath his eyes, kind of big ones, like that. And then maybe another eyelid line just on top. And we do the same thing. The other side. Like so. And then we have eyebrows, so like big frowning sort of... It's like a white clown mask or something as well. It's like take up like that, and then you have like an inside portion. And they're like skinny and weird looking. And then this side as well. One down there. They don't have to be even, you know, because the mask is like all sort of burnt and old, well, depending on what type of Michael Myers you want to do. Okay, so maybe like some extra frown lines and stuff here. And some coming across the head. Creepy. Like some lines coming out the corner up the side of that head there. Okay, so his nose, right? So say like the side of the nose just like curves down that way. You might have like a frowning sort of line here. And then nostrils there, because we're like, he's like looking down at us, right? just these two sort of zigzags and you can like shadow them up They're like two arrows pointing up right and then his nostrils around the side just come up and over the top of the nose there like that right like so and then maybe the side of the nose on this side as well So his mouth then, just down here, so we go, and it's kind of like, it's like he's smiling. Is he smiling or is this, it's kind of like, yeah, it's kind of like a smile upturned on the side a little bit. I got like some more sort of wrinkles in here and stuff. Right, so. Say like just underneath the eye, I would say. Just underneath, yeah, like the middle of his eye here is where you wanna sort of start this. 
okay and then it kind of curves up down in the middle back up here back down and sort of a bit of another curvy smile just here in the corner right and then his top lip just here like so and then this sort of line cleft lip in the middle like that and then his bottom lip kind of skinny just comes across here sort of dimples on the end there right so then he's got like these lines that come down just from his nose or his cheeks there and then his chin just kind of roundy chin there and then this has maybe another sort of chin line coming around his mouth there So his jaw then comes up the side of the head. And then goes up the side of the face. You could have like cheekbone lines in here. and then this white mask keeps going all the way around the head here and down the other side so now if you want to do like cracks and like dirt and scratches and stuff all over this because it's kind of an old mask you know, like little sort of scars and stuff like that, just to rough it up a bit. You can. Do, 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 do. So his ears then, just here, kind of in line with the eyes. So curving this way. And then around the earlobes here. You can add more lines and stuff inside this. Like so. And then this one's kind of covered by his hair on this side. So say we have like a sideburn, some long hair, and then the bottom of this ear. Just there. Just some more sort of ear lines there. So his neck, so we've got that, it's kind of like real wide, right? So it comes out from his jaw. Right, and it's got this sort of rubber end to the mask there. And you have like neck lines. Like that. Looks all blood on his face and stuff as well. Hmm. Okay, so hair, so in like different movies, he's got like long hair, short hair. I've drawn one with short hair. It's like the hair is all like sort of singed and burnt. So I might go long hair this time. 
bit different, longer sort of style. Yeah, like the, the older sort of version of him has like a long hair, I think. So we'll go with longer hair. So, say, like coming out from here, right? So you have like these sort of texture lines for the long hair. And then it'll just start, sort of start to flow out from here. Sort of bumpy at first. And you have all these texture lines and stuff on this, so. It just flows down behind this collar, which kind of comes out here, right? This one goes behind a knife. So we'll just add a little bit in here. And the collar comes out here. So he's got like, he's holding up a knife on this side, right? So you could join that, but I'll just wait till I draw the knife and then I can complete it. Because it'll save us having to erase stuff, you know? So that just goes behind his neck then there. And all these textures and stuff on the hair then. Do as much of this as you'd like. Okay. So he's got like a collar on this side and this side, but there's like a knife here and stuff. So the collar say, so see his neck sort of keeps going a little bit. You see his real neck going there and that way. And then he has a bit of collar that goes down that way. Kind of closes over there. And then there's like a t-shirt like that. And then we see like more neck muscles and stuff just in there. So the collar on this side then, just a pointy sort of, it's like a blue sort of overalls kind of a thing. Edge lines and folding lines and stuff. And then the shoulder comes out, down. If you're wondering how far out to bring the shoulder, it's normally the width of a face on a male character, right? So it's like the face, would bring it to like the edge of the shoulder more or less like when it starts to turn down there it's basically the face is kind of like the width of the collarbone so like where the collarbone would be say like face so your collarbone would be about here right, so that's about the width of the collarbone and then it starts to turn down male shoulders are three heads one two three and the other shoulder is like here somewhere but there's a hand and stuff you can mark it, so we'll go maybe there. Right, so we got a hand coming up here. See. So, another sort of part of his overalls here with a button. So, this hand and the knife, right? So, top of the knife is like here, top of the sort of hilt of it, the handle of it. Real exaggerated looking thing. And then we have another little lip that comes up and down. And then a big blade. It's kind of thin. And there's like some chunks taken out of it. But we'll just go. And it kind of curves at the top. And then we will go back down. It's a big crazy looking knife now. It's got like a bit of an edge to it here. Okay. And if you want like scratches and 
load on and stuff, you can do that. So his hand is holding this, so you got like a finger here. So, and he's got like red leather gloves on and stuff. So you got like his index finger here, which goes down like so. Red latex gloves even, right? And then knuckles for the back of the hand here. Just comes down. Like that, and then, so this finger sort of, just here and then down. And then the next one, down like so. You will have like some knuckle lines and stuff. And then the next finger. So one, two, three, yeah, this is the last. So this is like the little finger. And the palm of his hand just sort of goes down here. You've got like all these fold lines on the gloves. So, and then just the handle of the blade, we just finish it. Comes in, oh yeah, we can see his thumb as well. So it like goes, say down this way, and then the thumb is just here. And this kind of disappears, the back of the hand. And then the blade comes down this way. And then we can finish things just going in behind the knife. Some fold lines on his jacket. Like that. And again, like blood and like you could even put drips where I can put one like just coming off his coat here, like a big stain of blood there. Anywhere you want, really. And like dirt him up and scratches and you know make him creepy. Okay, Michael Myers from Halloween. Happy Halloween. See you in the next one. Bye.